Ed Reed's sudden departure from Bethune Cookman is a black eye for all HBCUs. The problem is the university is saying that Reed resigned. But during his press conference, Reed said he was pretty much forced out. He's forced out because of that tirade he launched last week on social media. Right or wrong, and he was sounds like he was right because he hadn't backed off what he said. He's never backed off anything he said before, so why would he start lying now? It's the fact they went out and said that he resigned. He didn't resign. He outshined the master, and now the university wants him to get back. It doesn't matter what Reed said was right or wrong. He outshined the university, and they can't take that, which is a problem. It's hard enough to attract the best black talent there is out there, and then when you get some of the best black talent, you run them off, how can you expect other top black talent to come to your institutions in the future? And that's the big problem with Ed Reed leaving HBCUs. It's a ripple effect. First Prime, now Reed, who's next?